What's up guys? Matt Co. Michael just pulled up, so let's go take a look and see what he's got today. Y'all come on. How's your week, man? Great. That's good. good. Great is very nice, okay. I know, it's been great. We've sold toolboxes, we've sold tools. We still got some stuff. Man, I, I wanted to call you Monday, but I wanted it to be a surprise. We finally got the pliers that I've been telling you about. There they are. There's some big daddies there. There's some big daddies, man. Big ones. Yeah, buddy. Now, if those small ones you get it, you know that will. Right? Oh, Makes you feel like a little boy holding something on it. <laughs> What do you think about them? Right, they're nice. They are nice. You think you can break something yeah. with them? I bet you could. She well, he breaks them with a rubber cheaper. hammer. <laughs> In that department. So here's some new pliers as well. They work really well. Uh, oh, for our yeah. body shops so you can and stuff. Get underneath them. Yeah, the clips and yeah. stuff. Yeah, body shop stuff. Really like them. Nice right there, buddy. Yeah. Very nice. Yeah, we. So those are new. Um, you got a new design tire inflator. I mean, it looks the same, right? But it, instead of using watch batteries now, it uses uh, AAA. Oh, okay. So, we updated it. Still got the brass hose. Well, not brass, I'm sorry. Still braided hose, mm. which I really like. But also, the battery is right there. So, no more screws. You just push it in and put you some AAAs. And cool. Good to go, right? Well, that's really nice. So we got a couple of new things on the truck this week. That's good. Had had some buy one get one offers, so we had some excitement that helped with this week as well. What pressure does that go up to? That's the same one I got. It'll go up to 110. I know. Let's read, Bill. I don't know what the max is. I don't like reading. I'll read, Bill. <laughs> I haven't been asked that. So Autism Awareness Month. Donate for your 175 chance. 175 psi. Now all it needs is that long air chuck on the end of it. Yeah. That'd be perfect. Yeah, we're doing a, uh, the district's doing a um, giveaway for an autism awareness. What, they're, what, it, what it is is there's a camp uh, that for autism kids they yeah. go to. So it, it's designed especially for them. So if it, you know, if, if they're afraid of loud noises, they adjust to that. But it lets, it lets kids with autism, they get to ride horses they get to do zip lines they get to do everything a normal kid can do so yeah. we're wanting to send 18 kids to it so everybody everybody in the district is taking donations for an entry in to win the toolbox so right. we uh we hope to send 18 i'd like to send just as many as we can that's good but up there it, it, it allows them to be uh or not be but do stuff that they don't normally get to do. They get to have uh, two or three people with them at all times. So it's not just one person trying to handle them. It's there's three of them yeah. and they cater to their needs. So if they're afraid of loud noises, there won't be loud noises. You know, if, if they're afraid of certain things then they eliminate that, it just lets them have fun for that week. So that's good. That's, that's a good thing right there. So yeah, we, we want to send as many kids as possible. So what you got there, that's something new in it. Green, well, those ain't new. Those are uh, the most hated tools ever, I believe. <laughs> At least they are for me. Especially um, if you're a hog. Well, <laughs> <laughs> well I'm a hog, but no, um, you, most of the time people relate those to doing like seat covers and stuff. Yeah. And if you're a Toyota tech and you had that heater, the, the seat heater recall, uh, you hate those things because you were doing Avalon's all kind of crazy siannas and everything else you're putting new uh seat heaters in and they sucked hey we got to do a little toyota job the other day we got to put an axle passenger side front axle in a sienna yeah okay it was uh a wheelbarrow. yeah did you get to do a wheelbarrow on it too it was an experience did it get seized in the little carrier yes yeah and we took uh, about a five foot pry bar and we beat the ever-living hail out of it we got it out of there <laughs> so next time just take your air hammer 
and put it on the little carrier. We tried that. We tried that. And then take your pry bar and do it at the same time. We tried that too. Did you? It wouldn't come out. It was, well, it was really and 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 there has been cases where I just unbolted it from the freaking block. That's what we we're about to do. Well, I've done that. Especially and me and we put the big Wilton twenty pound sledge <laughs> on there, and she. She finally gave up the ghost. Yeah, when we were doing the rings and the motors and stuff, that's one thing we had to do. We had to either sacrifice the time to take it off the block or fight that thing, and it was just whichever one was quicker, right? And it was a 32 millimeter, wasn't it? Ah, uh, yeah, 32 on the pack cars. I wonder if this right here fits the forward. 36. Maybe it's an ancient 716th conversion, whatever mm -hmm. that is. Don't get me lying to you. I did Lord have mercy. Does this fit saint. the, uh, do you know if this is a conversion to inch and seven sixteenths, like on the it. Ford 736Os? I have a kit. Yeah, I think so. <laughs> Let's see what this is. I have a kit. I That's a, a normal it. salesman pitch right there, Aunt <laughs> Bill. Go Don't buy it. the one you need, buy all of them, because yeah, you never know when you're going to need with a king. I mean, a, a nice little king case. Yes, it does come with a case. Oh. See? Bill's thinking right. Look at you there, Bill. Don't just buy one. No, well, you know, you asked me a buy question, them. I didn't know the answer to Buy them place, all. So. <laughs> I was just trying to buy <laughs> Don't just buy the one socket you need. Just buy the whole it entire set. It's a, they call it a Ford 6.0 liter oil filter socket. If that helps you. Anyway. That one? Yes. That is, Wally. That's that a Ford 6.0 oil filter socket. So don't buy the one. kit. Buy this one, Clay. <laughs> <laughs> this is what you need. What's the price on those two? Because this uh, one fits a Peterbilt. That one is $15.95. They're both $15.95. All right. What you found, Bill? I found nothing yet. Uh, let's see. What else we got? May just buy a receipt today. Uh-oh. No, we can't let you buy a receipt. We got to find Bill something. Uh-oh. <laughs> Bill needs something. What about you, Wally? Still thinking. Debating on a couple. Hey, don't think too hard now. Might explode. You, you burn it out this morning. You won't be no good this evening. Uh-oh. <laughs> uh -oh. Wally's almost got so much thinking juice today. It's like running a fuel tank. What's your gauge looking like, Wally? I don't know about half full. Uh -oh. Recharges during the night, so. You better get them. You better get one of the Red Bulls. <laughs> get some Red Bulls, he said. That's it. Wally, he ain't got a tank. I've got him something already. Yeah, yeah, I forgot about that. Yeah, that's true. I see Bill's wheels turning now. I'll be done. Y'all put these Matco ratchets on sale, cheap. I ain't got a Matco ratchet. Bill ain't got a Matco ratchet. Wally ain't got a Matco ratchet. I used to have. We're Matco ratchet -less. Well, they have got... Uh, I was not a fan because all of them lock on the brake neck. Do what now? I'm not a fan of the lock and brake neck. Are you not? I don't have on the first one, even on Snap-on, that's lock and brake neck. Wow. You don't like to unlock it, right? I realize that. Honestly, but I always bump him and lock him where I don't want That him. lock style, I like it better than the snap-on ratchet. So, you know, you're right the opposite, Wally, which that's fine. If you want to be opposite than everybody, you can. <laughs> I love the locking Everybody else says is. they hate the fact that they don't lock. They say it just flops. I yeah. mean, you're just a flopper, I guess. Yeah, I'm, I'm a floppy kind of guy. That's fine. Wally said it feels good to hold something in his hand that finally flops. <laughs> <laughs> wow. <laughs> All right. <laughs> oh. oh my goodness. Well, I gotta remind me every day. That's why I use it so much. <laughs> Pick on Wally, Benny. <laughs> Wally, you know. So that's what it feels like to flop. If I didn't love you, I wouldn't pick on you, right? You must really love I me, do. then. I do love me some Wally now. I think everybody else loves Wally, they too. They do have the uh, half inch ratchets on sale, I doubt that's what you need. Uh, they but moved them like to 57 this week. Yeah. I'm thinking about one. Well, I thought that's what it was, and I looked it up. But uh, they should be on sale. Let me see. Let me see if I can. I'm wanting to say, but it was the half-inch um, the three-eighths locking. That's the step. That's the step, man. Yeah. 
Pebble. But I had to have it locking for going on the top of the bell housing, so yeah. I wouldn't drop my sock out. Yeah, absolutely. Locking extensions is the way best. To go. If you got room for a locking extension, that's the way to go. I'd rather have it solid half inch on both ends and be done with it. I that way you that can put a reducer on it if you want to. Yeah. I like it because all my three eighths is smaller than my half inch, so it can fit in tight spots. Lower profile. Mm hmm. It's warranted if it breaks. Well, I guarantee you we'll put it to the test at this shop. What you saying? I'm just saying. You saying you rough on tools? We don't know. I'm just saying we don't have our tools I for am. good looks. I'm really rough on tools. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we work You need powder here. coated instead of just black oxide coating. Yeah. See, Wally needs powder coating on his stuff. <laughs> no, it might scratch oh. off even that. Uh -huh. So I actually picked this one up on sale, Polly. Um, normally 170 I can sell it to you for about 140 Hundred and forty dollars. Yeah. Now that's the only one I got left. I picked a few up on sale. So if you want a green, you're out of luck. <laughs> <laughs> and it may not be for you, but I was just you said you wanted it on sale, so I saw what I do, right? Yeah. Can't always do that. I'm getting away from green too, so. Yeah, Bill is done with well, green. green with if you're trying to throw a sales pitch on me and, and it's green. <laughs> You're wasting your breath. I really like that Macro Creek. I like that the Wally's got. What, what you think? He must be like Wally. Wally listen to him. He does. He even have the, mm -hmm. the it used to be Wally saying like I want to be like Bill. Now it's the, <laughs> the tables have turned. They do Wally. Yes. <laughs> what you so think about a ratchet? Well, I was looking at this right here. I knew um, about this time last year, Macro was bragging one. that they had the longest oh, ratchet on the market. And I was wondering if this is one of them. I think it was like standing up that way everybody can see him. He could use that as a walking stick if yes. you uh, he could Actually, like one, Heck yeah. You gonna buy all that and we'll talk him into giving us a deal? Cane. You know what? You gonna buy that and we'll see what he'll do on a deal on a tire? Let's see. Let's see. Price is right. That's it. Kind of like, uh, what's his Ain't name? Copyrighted? Bob Barker? Yeah. <laughs> That's a hey, long this is the 36 long, inch one? Yeah. Yes. And we do have the non flex head um, ratchets now in the half inch. It's been a long time coming, but we finally got them. Wally said if you get your heart right, we'll buy two ratchets from you today. Is that what he said? What are you saying? He said it's kind of like Bob Barker. If you get the price right, the <laughs> price is right now. Who, who picked that up? Steve, uh, who picked that up when he went out? Price is right. Is it Steve uh, Harvey? Yeah, Steve Harvey. Yeah. I don't know. I don't ever watch TV. Well, you know, as a kid, like it was, uh, it was Price is Right and Days of Our Lives, and then uh, what was after that? I'll be right back. It was something after that. But if you were up at my grandma's house, if you just that's had what to you stay had up to through, watch. Yeah, if you stayed up through nap time, that's what you had to suffer and watch. Price is Right was all right, but then Days of Our Lives and that one that come after it, I didn't know what it was. See, Price I thought the Price is Right was a cool show. That's what know. I'm saying. Price is Right was yeah. awesome. So you stayed up to watch that, but then you got suckered into, uh-uh, you're still awake. You got to watch Days Day of Our lives. lives. So it was kind of a, you know, you had to make that decision. There wasn't no change in no cartoon to Grandma's house. Mm -hmm. No, no, that was her time. Will of Fortune, Jeopardy? Mm-mm. No, we, uh... You could play hard, but when it was nap time, you either napped or you watched those. I did like Price is Right, though. I thought that was a pretty cool show. Yeah. You remember that show that they used to have that come on TV had the whammies on there? Yeah. Yeah. Well, it had whammies and the little devils. And, yeah. Yeah. Um, you know, the Game Network used to carry all those. I haven't looked, seen it. I used to like it just so I could watch them little cartoon <laughs> people run across the screen. And yeah. <laughs> What's the name of that show? I remember that. No whammies, no whammies, no whammies. I don't really say that. Yeah. It is low profile. It's low profile. It's got a lifetime warranty on the board. The wheels are updated. They're not like Willie, uh, Wally's wheels anymore. Wally got new wheels, remember? When did he get new wheels? You you sold him some new wheels. That's not right. long ago. I haven't. I don't think I've got any new wheels. Yeah. Hey. He changed them out whether they're changing it or not. He didn't get them, man. He would have got the updated wheels. His are gray. Yeah. And they kind of, yeah, that's what Wally Okay. Is. Well, that's the new upgraded wheels then. I'm pretty sure you sold him in one. Well, then I did. I probably did. I, yeah, I probably did. That's about five weeks ago. That's a long time. Because we that's helped right. him put them in. 
Well, my wife told me last week, she said, you need a new creeper, don't you? And I was like, yep, mm -hmm. sure do. Mm -hmm. you, you got a smart wife, man. Right there it is. I sure do. It's orange. Yeah, I can't really you and Wally can have a Metco Creeper race. <laughs> Oil your wheels up good and don't tell him ahead I'd of time. I'd like to see how Diesel reacted to that. Oh, he likes creepers. He <laughs> he wants to ride on your belly when you roll across the floor on a creeper. And somehow he always manages to get that ball underneath the creeper. So while you're yeah. under a truck working on it, he got his nose in under your creeper trying to get his ball out. <laughs> All right, guys, Wally's still out there, Wally gagging around, but we got, each one of us got one of these power outlets like Bill got last week, super awesome. We used it in the truck right after Michael left, and we, I don't think it was probably 30 minutes after you left, I texted you and said we both had one. So. I don't even know that it was 20 minutes. <laughs> it, was, it was quick. It was fast, so I'm going to get one of these, and I'm going to buy this. 32 millimeter that fits the pack car oil filters and this one fits the 6.0 that we just got in our service truck so then i guess i'm gonna buy a matco lock-in flex head ratchet apparently wally's getting this and we don't know here because i say wally's lolly there he comes yep, I'm back. so um anyway that's what i'm getting this week and bill's getting what you getting? I just buy a receipt. A receipt. I don't know. We got the creeper. You need a creeper. That's the awesome creeper. Still undecided creeper. on the creeper. Well, we're going to work on the creeper. He needs a creeper. He needs a creeper. His wife told him to get a How creeper. How much do you think that'd be worth? Two. A little more than two. A little more than two? Yeah. It's on sale. It is on sale. It is on sale. It's, it's Michael's sale. Need two and a quarter? Uh, it's normally three or four. I got it on sale for two seventy five. Oh, shit. You need it so me and Clay can try it out inside if we want one like that. So if they break it, is it still warranted? Uh, yeah. Okay, good. If they break it, me, we break it, it doesn't matter. If all three of us are standing on it, it's still warranted. Everybody's waiting on your decision, Wally. Mm. Now turn around and talk you know about the creeper. Yeah. If you get the creeper, I'll pull the trigger on this, Bill. Bill's getting the creeper. Ooh. Yes, I get my creeper back. Hey, yes, it's that, that trunk right there. That worked out in my favor. I like that. You're the winner at all. Of that's it. right. <laughs> I wasn't right, that decision. So that's what we're getting. Bill's getting a new orange <laughs> Matco creeper. Wally's getting an 11 and a half foot ratchet. And some socks. Well, the wife's been griping it because I've been wearing the white long ones and they've been getting greasy. So you need socks. I agree. So I'll get the socks. black ones. So I'm getting the ratchet. Wally's also getting the power port. And I'm getting the two oil filter cap sockets. Anyway, guys, like always, thanks for watching this video. Go check out Michael's Facebook, Matco Michael on Facebook. You can see all his stuff he's got on there. What do they need to do, Wally? Like, subscribe. Don't cost a dime. Hit that thumbs up and click that subscribe button right down here. It's totally free. Free. Just remember, guys, if, you want, if you're if you looking at a career change, hit me up on Facebook and let me help you out. There you go. You could be the next one riding. You could be the next Matco Michael. That's right. Or Matco George or Matco John or whatever your name is. Even a Matco Susan or Jill, right? That's right. I don't care. We do have some female distributors, and they do really well. There you go, guys. Hit that thumbs up. Click that subscribe. Catch you next time. See ya. All right, guys, let me show you how rough Wally is on his toes. He's just walking off the Matco truck. Y'all can see he's got his receipt and all of his stuff. Oh, this is how rough Wally is on his toes. I mean, not even Focus. five minutes. It ain't been five minutes. But look, he's done Is that the, warranted? He's done got the end. <laughs> <laughs> it ain't broke. He's done got the end all skin. I, I told y'all he was rough on his toes. I don't know what he was doing with it. It's my car. All right, so here's the uh, snap-on ratchet. And the Matco ratchet side by side. Big difference. <laughs>